higher than ever. And some of the biggest expenses have nothing to do with your mortgage payment. Homeowners insurance costs, for example, are up 4.6% from last year, according to the latest inflation report. They are at historical levels right now, but they are moderating. The fact that the rate increases are moderating is a good sign that we are seeing more stability in the home insurance market. The reason for the rise, experts say, is twofold. The cost of repairs and the materials you need to do them are going up. And the number of people filing claims is climbing after more and more severe natural disasters. The Economist makes the case in its cover story this week, climate change is only going to make it worse, potentially wiping out about a tenth of the value of the world's housing by 2050. These companies are taking a look at their numbers and they're having to adjust it to a new level of risk expectation. The insurance comparison platform Insurify projects homeowners insurance premiums are on track to climb by 6% by the end of the year, hitting more than $2,500 on average. These companies um, you know, are going to have to keep raising rates to keep up with increasing number of natural disasters. Fannie Mae says as of 2022, insurance combined with utilities, property taxes, and home improvement expenses account for more than half of the costs of owning a home. More recent data from Fannie Mae finds nearly one in 10 insured homeowners aren't confident that they'd be able to afford their insurance premiums at their next renewal date. Brett?